stopped by customs on my way here, which I know. What? Surprising. It's awful, man. I didn't know what it was for either. They picked me out of a line. I got, it was like. <laughs> I got all excited, high five some kids, shook hands with the pilot, motorboated some woman. It was weird. It was weird. They took me in the back room, searched through all my stuff. And when you go to leave the special screening area, customs, you walk down this long hallway, feeds into this small lobby, and that opens up to the arrivals area, right? When I got to the lobby, there was this really cute girl there. You know, like really kind of, you see her, you're like, ah, you know, like, ah, you know, like, ah, you know, it's like, oh, no, go to, oh, you know, like, it's like, oh, you know, you know, see her, it's like, oh, you know, like, oh, you know, it's like, ah, you know, it's like, ah, you know, it's right? just, you know, it's the kind of girl personality, you just want to, you know, like, it's just, you just want to, like she's just, nah, you know, mm, you know, nah, you know, right? So I smiled at her, right? I was just like, oh, what's up, you know, ding, you know? And then, and then she smiled at me, and I was like, ah, you know, right? jello pudding, right? And, uh, and I would have gone and talked to her, but, you know, I didn't want us to rush into things. <laughs> and I went to exit the lobby, and I went to open this door that was between these two floor-to-ceiling windows. And I went to push it, but it didn't open. And it didn't have a handle for me to pull, so I thought, oh, no, this must be an automatic door. So I took a step back and I just waited for a second. But it still didn't open. So I thought, oh, it's maybe I just didn't trigger the motion sensor. So I started waving my arm in the air. <laughs> but it still didn't open. And I was terrified the girl was watching all this. So I thought, oh, maybe I just didn't push hard enough. So I went back and I started pushing with all of my strength. And then I realized that those weren't two floor to ceiling windows on either side of a door. Those were two glass doors on either side of a wall. <laughs> One full minute I was trying to open a wall <laughs> by pushing it, by standing still in front of it, by waving at it, <laughs> and then by pushing it so hard that I was physically leaning into it. And instead of turning around, like cracking a joke with the girl and acknowledging my mistake, I continued pushing <laughs> and pretended that I was stretching my calves. <laughs> And I didn't want to short sell it. So after I finished with my calves, I started stretching my hamstrings, right? And then I stretched my glutes, right? Then I kind of casually turned around. The girl had tears coming down her cheeks. She was laughing so hard. And I wasn't sure if it was because she had realized that I'd mistaken a wall for a door, or if it was because I had spent so much time stretching my butt muscles after I'd been screened by customs.